it makes you sad all the time because I think you start to think like, why does this have to happen to me? And it makes you sad and like depressed and you start thinking really, really bad thoughts, which aren't good. And then it makes it like, you're more sad, so your pain hurts more. When we've got pain and all the time, our brains are always thinking, thinking, thinking. And the thoughts, each idea that we're having, um, affects what we're gonna do. So sometimes we have really helpful thoughts that say, you're gonna have a great day today and we leap out of bed and we feel really positive with that thought. It's gonna be a great day today. On the other hand, sometimes we have thoughts that are maybe less helpful like, oh, it's a miserable day outside. I'm really worried about today and how it's gonna go. And then those thoughts can stop us or be an obstacle, I guess, to doing the things that will then might actually bring us some joy and, and make us feel like our life has meaning. Pain, um, it is triggered also by thoughts. I mean, it, it, thoughts, if you, if, you, if you think that it's gonna get worse, I mean, it might feel a bit worse. So my psychologist has taught me not to listen to that. And if I think it will eventually get better, listen to that. It's important the first step to recognise that they are thoughts, that you're having a thought. Recognise what that thought is. Um, some ways to do that are to take a breath, step back and think, well, hang on, that's just a thought. Um, another example would be um, if you're thinking about going to school and your thought is, well, I'm worried my friends won't want to be with me if I have pain today. Now, that thought could then make you feel like even more reason to stay home. But if you recognise that it's just a thought, it's not reality, it's not necessarily true. In fact, most of your friends would dearly miss you if you don't turn up today, but that's not what you're thinking. You're thinking, my friends don't want to see me, but it's just a thought. Recognise it as a thought and then you can challenge it and maybe replace it with another thought that is helpful, that can help you get going, get moving and do the things that will make your day fun. There was a few times where I like gave up and I just didn't want to leave my bedroom and you know, I kept like, I'd give up and then the next day I'd think, well, what are you doing? Like, just keep trying, keep trying and I did and then now look at me, I'm walking again.